Hi, my name is Mark Renz. I'm with the University of Wisconsin Extension and I'm here to talk to you today about how to identify garlic mustard. Garlic mustard is an invasive plant that's been in Wisconsin for many years, typically associated with forested areas, although recently it has been spreading into roadside areas and is becoming problematic. It's fairly easy to identify because it has unique characteristics and it's one of the first to emerge and start to flower in the season. As you can see right here, if we look at the flowers, it has distinct white flowers with four petals and has these unique fruits on them called saliques, which are quite distinctive, again, one of the first white flowering plants that we see in Wisconsin in the spring. Looking back though, this is a biennial plant and what happens is, is it first germinates early in the spring around the 1st of April and emerges and what we see with the seedlings is we tend to see a carpet of seedlings that occur, as you can see down here, uh, dominating the understory. And this is another key way to characterize or identify these plants. If you're unsure if this, this is garlic mustard, take a leaf, crush it, smell it. It typically has a unique garlicky type odor to it that is quite distinctive. Another key characteristic to look at and identify in adult garlic mustard plants is to pull one up and uproot it, and as you'll see, it'll have a unique kink present in the root. Some people refer to it as an S, and this is another key characteristic. So again, garlic mustard is relatively easy to identify because it's probably one of the first ones to emerge, has a distinct garlicky smell when crushing the foliage, and is one of the first white flowered plants to emerge and be common. Again, good luck with identifying garlic mustard and happy weeding.